My name is Jason Courtney, president of Helitech Civil Construction. Today, we are in beautiful downtown St. Louis at the new site of Ballpark Village. This next phase of development includes a site of over 700,000 square feet for a 29-story residential tower, a 10-story office building, an eight-story hotel, and a three-story retail and entertainment facility. So today at this site, we are doing ground improvement using a top feed vibratory stone column method. This ground improvement is being installed so that we can meet the required loads for this particular project. Vibratory stone columns are used to mitigate any future settlement on these particular buildings. It also increases the bearing pressure of this job site. So what's very unique about this particular job site is all of the urban fills that are located below ground. The urban fills on this particular job site consist of asphalt, concrete, debris, brick fragments, wood, and other miscellaneous debris that are left over from the previous existing building that was torn down. Due to the urban fills, we are unable to drive our vibratory probe to depth. Therefore, we are having to pre-drill each and every one of these holes through the urban fill so that we can install the vibratory stone column correctly. The vibratory stone columns are being placed in a grid pattern under the proposed foundation locations to mitigate settlements and increase the bearing pressure of the soils. All of the vibratory stone columns will be extended to a minimum of 30 feet to ensure that all of the VSC elements extend through the urban fills that are present. The foundations have been designed for an allowable bearing pressure in excess of 4,000 PSF. The largest foundations have a total column load of in excess of over 700 tips. Given Helitech's vast experience in geotechnical science with our ground improvement methods, whether you have peats, organics, soft soils, or even here, urban fill environments, we are able to still provide cost-effective solutions for our clients and owners.